Today I'm going to walk you through the process of how to update your iPhone. My name is Trevor, this is NerdLearn, let's get started. I have to unlock the phone and get into settings. And then we're going to click on general and software update. So we notice that there's no bubble indicator telling us that there's an operating system update. And usually what happens is when the software update is pretty new and released from Apple or the phone has been turned off uh, for a long time, like in my case, this is my spare phone. So after tapping on the software update, the phone reaches out to Apple and just like that, right, there's an update. So that's the update. Um, I hit download and install and now we wait and it took about four minutes or so. Once the download finishes, we're going into the uh, preparing and like verification phase. It took about 28 minutes to finish downloading. So uh, lots of time you can go grab a snack or goof off on your phone. The phone is still workable uh, during this time frame. Once it downloaded everything, it spent about a minute doing the verifying the update before kicking off a reboot. And then next we have the reboot and uh, the installation. So you're gonna see the familiar Apple logo and the progress bar. Uh, that's a good sign because we know that the phone actually worked and it is not bricked. Uh, this step took about eight minutes to complete. So the phone restarts, you just unlock it and now you're running the latest operating system. So pretty simple. So if you haven't set up all of your Apple Pay and uh, other items, each time you do your operating system update, you're going to go through these prompts. So I don't want to set any of this up. So I'm going to click on continue. And set up later. And set up later in settings. Don't share. And now we can finally actually use the phone. Uh, so while it's fresh on my mind, um, I want to get rid of these things. Because in a couple days, it's going to prompt me again. So in order to do that, we're going to click on settings. And we can see this finish setting up your phone. So we tap that, finish setting up. And this reactivates the same wizard as before. But now by choosing all these later options, uh, it does not prompt us until the next operating system update. Thanks for sticking with me through the quick update tutorial. I hope this video helped and be sure to like and subscribe for more tech tips and walkthroughs. Till next time, happy updating.